Hi, I'm Daniel. It's actually a cold morning in Phoenix, Arizona. I love it. I see a world in which men are just as affectionate with each other as male cats are with each other, in which men are just as comfortable being affectionate with another male friend as they are petting their male dog or cat. I know that for most of us, this world doesn't exist yet, but I don't care, I still see it. I am fortunate enough now to have a few male friends that agree with me, and I've cuddled with them, I've held their hands, put my arms around them, hugged them. I even slept with a friend, and when I say slept with, I literally mean slept with. We had a cuddle and a sleep, uh, what do you call it? Uh, sleepover, cuddle in the morning, cuddle at night, um, you know, and it was wonderful. And uh, there was no sex involved, there was no kissing involved, it was just pure platonic cuddling. So um, I just wanted to put this out there because I'm sure there are probably other men that feel the same way and because I would really like to help make the world a better place. You know, as the song from the 60s goes, what the world needs now is love, sweet love. And, um, you know, there's no sweeter love than just the affection between friends. Well, actually, I have a husband and that love is pretty sweet too. <laughs> Maybe even sweeter. But um, the affection that men can have for each other, just as friends, is beautiful and healing and comforting, and uh, I really would like to see more of it. I also happen to be trained and certified by Cuddlist, and so I understand all about boundaries and consent and keeping things platonic in nature, and so I'm also available as a professional cuddler. If any man would like to try cuddling with another man that he can trust, I'm that man. And um, if any of you guys out there just want to cuddle with each other, go right ahead. <laughs> All right, I'll sign off now and uh, hope this helped.